my lukewarm summer may just turn to a hot girl summer. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. Welcome back to another edition of Fab Friday. Why am I doing so much with my hands? This is a special edition of Fab Friday because it is a hair edition. Let me go ahead and tell you guys right now, this video is brought to you by City Beauty World. Yes, they sponsored your girl. Ooh. I will be featuring two units in this video. One they sent me, which is the one I have right now, and then one I actually purchased. But before we get into all the spec and what I think about these units straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also, give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Now I'm gonna enter some footage of me laying this unit down and then we'll come back, unwrap this bad boy, and talk about the specs of this first unit. Let's go. So this is how she is looking after I didn't laid her down, sweetie. This is the Latosh Senegalese Full Lace Wig. I got her in a color natural black for the specs that I got. She does retail for $169.44. Please be aware that price point can go up or down depending on the specs that you get in this unit. When you order in a unit from City Beauty World, you can put certain specs for the unit so you make sure you get it custom to you or you can ask for an actual customization to your unit. So the things that you can already for right in the drop downs are listed right here on the screen so you can choose the base type so whether it's a full lace wig or a frontal you can also choose the cap color if you want baby hairs no baby hairs sparse or full baby hairs as well as additional accessories whether it be elastic bands or combs and the full cap size so small medium or large this unit did come in a medium cap size however you guys know my head is humongous 23 inches to be exact so this one was a little bit smaller but when I cut the lace off it did stretch it a little bit um, but make sure you just go ahead and get the correct cap size for yourself so you don't have any type of issues with laying this unit down or it's not squeezing on your head I will tell you guys though even though I got a medium cap size for this unit the unit does fit pretty good it's just a little bit too short in the back but the elastic band does come all the way down so unfortunately I wouldn't be able to wear this unit in any, in, in any type of up styles because you know you can see my hair clearly but I, I could definitely do a half up half down for this unit also with these units every single unit that comes out of City Beauty World, the knots are already pre-bleached. They bleach the knots really, really well, you guys, to make it look like some scalp. Now, the lace that I got for this unit is the medium brown. However, I believe they are introducing soon or they just start to introduce the transparent lace. So make sure you tell them what lace you want for your unit. Fun fact, usually I go in with my powder and put it on top and actually put it in my parts. I literally just put a little bit under the cap this time, as you guys saw, and it worked out just fine. Like it's blending down with my skin tone just fine okay the baby hairs on this was sparse um however that's still a lot for me especially on the side so i did go in as you saw and pluck some of those out i did get little accessories on my unit got the little silver hoops you can get those or you don't get you don't have to get those those are optional if you want other customizations to your unit when you're checking out they have a little uh, additional comments box i believe and you can drop those comments there saying hey i want this this and this on my unit i don't want this add this or whatever else if you want to do all black with like a hint of some blonde you know braids up in there then you can put that in your customization they can make your unit how you want if you have any additional questions make sure you dm them on instagram they get back to you super fast like when i say fast like they don't sleep they do not sleep they are working around the clock you guys to get these units out for us so make sure you tell them exactly what you want before that unit goes out as always their shipping was really fast once she told me my unit was ready i had it within the week even from nigeria and they ship dhl oh in regards to shipping let me show you guys the new packaging they have they used to have like the little plastic baggie um which was still cute it was practical it served its purpose it protected the unit but now they have these bags now i'm not sure if this is just for certain units or whatever but this is cute my units both came in this bag and they were clipped to a hanger that hung up here i can't find the hanger right now but they were clipped to a hanger and it was like a little suit was being delivered to me like it was folded up in the DHL package but once I unfolded it it was like a little suit was hanging up in my bag so I can literally put the units back in this bag on the hanger once I find it and hang it up so they're not just laying around other than the cap being too small for me I think this unit is really pretty I normally do not go for long twist units like this I have never 
ever worn Senegalese twists. They just were never really my thing. But this is actually really cute. Let me show you guys what it looks like up close. So the hair, like I said, is pre-bleached and the hair starts off braided and then it goes into the twist as you can see. This is what the end of the braid looks like. So as usual, very, very neat. They did not skimp on the neatness of this hair. It's not ratty, it's not tingling. The hair feels good, it's a good weight to it. Like it looks like you went to the shop and got your hair braided without the tension on your scalp. Y'all know how I feel, save the edges. I literally can take this off right now and be good to go. Like you can't ignore that kind of service, you just can't. I'm not great with the baby hair, so don't come for me. But because the unit was too short, I did kind of push some of the baby hair back, but it comes down right on my the top of my ear which you know worked out perfectly it's just obviously the back is not you know coming all the way down but i will show you guys the back let me spin around real quick so this is what i'm talking about how it doesn't come all the way down on my hairline how it doesn't come all the way down onto my neck normally you would want it to come obviously all the way down but that is that band is holding that bad boy in there it's secure okay here i'm hoping you guys can see this but that's how it's looking this is how the hair looks in the back, all the parts, okay? Let's show you from the side. Like, see how that looks? Like, they do an awesome job, you guys, on these units. Unmatched, unmatched. This unit only comes with the elastic band and the adjustable straps that are um, sewn into the unit, so if you wanna use those, you can. I didn't use no got to be in this, I just used my uh, eco styler to lay the edges down and that was it the rest is the elastic bands holding some place and it's not going nowhere <laughs> it's not going nowhere not not a single inch okay not a single inch like look at that from the scalp I, this whole video is a catfish i actually went and got my hair done this ain't a wig i went and got my hair done because you can't tell me this is a wig you just mm -mm. Y'all, let me stand up so you guys can see. This one that I got is waist length. You guys know I am 5'6". So it does come down to my waist. This is how it is looking in the back. I know this unit is expensive, but most of y'all be wearing braids. And y'all be spending more in a shop than what this costs. Where's the lie? It's an investment that lasts a long time. I still got both my other units, Dara and Adur. In the packaging, if I wanna take this one off right now and go put the other one on, guess what? I can do that. I can change my braids three times in one day and still look like I just got them done. I'm just telling you guys, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. But yeah, y'all, this one is cute. I really like it. All the information for this unit will be linked down below, so make sure you guys check them out. But let's go ahead and change it up real quick. I'm gonna put on my other unit, and then I'll be right back to talk about that one and the specs. This is the second twist unit, y'all. Now, if y'all thought the first one was good, let me just tell you. Uh, what's the kids to be doing? Mm -mm. <laughs> this one is my favorite out of the two. Um, right out the gate, y'all can tell why. Like, y'all can just, you see it? Now, this unit was a special order. I requested them to do this one. It doesn't really have an exact name right now, but it is a play off the Isioma triangle braids, but instead of having them in the regular three strand uh, braided style, I got them in the twist. And, uh, I also requested to have some of the hair um, out, like single hair out with like little curlies. Just like the first one, this does come with the medium brown lace with the pre-bleached knots. You also can special order this or request what you want as far as the color, length, things like that. I did get this in a bra strap length so it comes down just above my chest um, and you can still see here in the back it just at the bra strap um, bra strap length right there this is how the parting is looking y'all look at that parting 
did get the sparse baby hairs on this one as well. I did get this one in a large cap. It came with the adjustable band um, in the back as well as the adjustable straps. Now with this one, as you saw in the first one, the band was unattached. Um, that's because I went in and cut it because the cap was too small, obviously. So I needed it to come down a little bit. With this one, I left the band, the elastic band attached to the cap to make sure that both the elastic band and the back of the wig came down at the same time. Because you don't have combs in this unit. So when you don't have combs in a unit, you wanna make sure it lays as flat as possible. So that is why they stitch the elastic band in the back of the cap so that it lays down with the elastic band and you don't have to like repin it or anything like that. Now, even though this is a large cap, um, it was a little bit too long on my sides actually, um, which was surprising. So I'm not mad at that. I just had to go in and cut it up a little bit further. As you guys can see, there's still some lace right there see the lace there there's still some lace so i just kind of took the baby hair and kind of like moved it back onto that part so it didn't look you know it didn't look too bad um and it worked out just fine again this is what that side is looking like this is what this side is looking like you can see right here this is what i'm talking about with the lace like it was a little bit too big for my the lace was just a little bit long on the sides but again i'd rather have too much lace on a unit than not enough make sure you are measuring your head correctly to make sure you get the right size cap you don't want to go too small and you don't want to go too big you want to make sure the cap it fits right for you add this one in a natural black um this one can also be pinned up it's like a little ponytail situation look how that is looking y'all <laughs> This is how it is looking in the back. Let me pull some of the hair up. Again, it comes all the way down onto my neck, so that is perfect. Now, they did leave out, as I requested, some of the hair, and she actually did curl these for me. However, you can straighten this out if you want to and recurl them. They're not as perfect as they were, um, when she did it because obviously they had to be shipped and they were like, you know, folded up in the pack. If I want to go in and add, let me add some little, if I add some little beads, how that's gonna look? How that's gonna look? Oh, oh, wee. Turn it up, turn it up. This wig is bomb. This wig is bomb. Okay, and the ends are super cute, okay? What the, I can still see you. I just saw you come down, which is why I was like, what the I'm invisible. Okay, hot boy, negative zero. <laughs> My lukewarm summer may just turn into a hot girl summer. Okay, let me check my knees, get my little icy hot ready, and then we're gonna be we're gonna be in there. We're gonna be in there. This is what the ends are looking like. They curl the ends as well to give me this like little Shirley Temple tight twisty curl thing. Corkscrew boo. <laughs> And again, with this one, it has the braid starting at the top and then it goes down to the twist. I definitely would have um, loved the twist to have started at the top, but since it was just like a play off of that other unit, that's why it has the braids at the top and then goes down into the twist. But you can't really tell, so I'm not complaining about it. It's not too heavy. There is some weight to this, but it's not that many braids, so it's not making my head feel like you know, heavy. And guess what? My scalp don't hurt. I'm not pulling back on my edges. My neck don't hurt. I don't gotta sleep like this. Once again, you, you see what I'm going with this? You see where I'm going with this, okay? You see where I'm going with it. Save the edges, save the neck. I will link all information for both units down below so you wanna check them out, you can. If you guys have any questions for me as far as the units that I featured in this video, make sure you go ahead and leave them in the comment section down below. Shout out once again to City Beauty World for sending me this unit and trusting in my brand to share this with you guys. I really appreciate it. But that's all I got for you guys today. What am I doing with my hands again? My hands. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share once again if you like this video. Don't forget to smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.